Good morning, everyone, and welcome to a realistic morning in my life. I'm currently 27 weeks pregnant, and I have a one and two year old. So on the agenda for today, we're just gonna go to Dunkin'. I have a Target order I need to pick up. And then uh, my one year old Tommy has a doctor's appointment. Then just the usual cooking and cleaning before my parents come over to watch them for the night. I do have to go to work after, and um, my husband's working as well, so my parents are gonna come over and watch them for us. So my two-year-old Jeffrey was up at 6 a.m. this morning, which is really not ideal because I work until midnight. Each time I go to bed, it's like 1 a.m. And he decided to get up at 6 this morning, so it was a little rough for me. He is wide awake. I'm exhausted. This is not ideal, but I guess this is realistic. So. Do I work it? Yeah, Dada went to work. Does anyone else's toddlers constantly get one of their arms out of some of their um, pajamas? I don't know why, but this certain pair of pajamas he always seems to get one arm out of. It's like one of the first times I got to unload the dishwasher without the boys swarming it. It was great. I got it done so much faster.
you guys. So I'm just going to go to Dunkin', then pick up my Target order. And then my one-year-old Tommy has a doctor appointment. So um, i got to bring my older one with me because my husband's working today. But that's on the agenda. So. All right, you guys. Just got me Dunkin'. Um, I've been getting the Strawberry Dragon Fruit Refresher. We have the app there, $2 this month. Um, I was getting coffee, but my stomach has been getting really upset lately. I don't know if it's due to the pregnancy, but um, I cut out the coffee. Been feeling a little better. So I'm getting this. It's actually really pretty. Um, it's this really pretty, like, ombre. It's pretty good. And then this has been, like, one of my, my cravings. I eat these more than I should be. Uh, the maple frosted donuts are so good. This is my current like pregnancy craving. It's actually funny because um, the old wives tales always say if you're craving sweets, you're having a girl. And with all three of my boys, I've had such a big sweet tooth. So I think that one is a, um, that one's not real for me. But yeah, just gonna enjoy my donut and we're gonna drive to Target and um, I have an order I need to pick up. Probably the best thing to come from Target these past few years is the Target drive up. Um, I feel so much safer just pulling up, having them load everything in for me. Um, I hear so many stories of people being like stalked, specifically in this Target um, near me. People with kids. Um, so it's great if I don't have to go in. And any of you parents out there, that have toddlers and little kids, you know, it can be so difficult bringing them into a store. It's just a lot of work. And this helps um, reduce that stress. <laughs> so thank you Target for adding that this past few years. All right, you guys, so just picked up my Target order and now I have to go to Tommy, my one year old 15 month checkup. So we're gonna head over there now and then once we get back, we'll have some lunch. So here's my Target haul that I just picked up. The boys needed regular diapers and overnights. I highly recommend Up and Up brand. I think their diapers are great and super affordable. Um, and then I got Uncrustables for the boys. Um, I love this Reed's ginger ale. It doesn't have high fructose corn syrup in it. Um, and I think it tastes a lot better than like Canada Dry or... Um, the Schweppes one. Then next up I got Rice Krispies and Mini Marshmallows. My husband wanted me to make him some Rice Krispie treats the other day, so I'm going to make those for him tomorrow. And I just got some chocolate rice cakes. Okay, then I got this brownie mix. Um, that's been another like kind of pregnancy craving of mine. Like really chewy, fudgy brownies. So good. Uh, so I picked up one of these. And then I got these. I've never had these... Um, Crunchy dipped chocolate granola squares, but they looked good, so I'm gonna give them a try. And finally, I just got this styling gel for um, my two year old. I did cut his hair the other day, <laughs> and I botched it initially. It looked like, it looked horrible. I felt so bad. It looked like, like a bowl cut, kinda. Um, but I think I fixed it. Um, and then I just got the styling gel, just to hold his hair in place and make it look. Um, that much better. Yep, so there's my haul. And now I'm just going to give them some lunch. Alright, so this is Jeffrey. Here's his haircut that I did the other day. I shaved the sides, and then I wanted to keep it a little longer on the top. But I just have that styling gel. Just want to run it through. Just to make sure it stays to this side. It tends to like keep wanting to come in the middle. I think it looks a lot better just off to one side. But there's my handsome man. Can you say hi? Can you say hi, cutie pie? He's eating a rice cake. You like rice cakes? Little snack before lunch. Hopefully he still eats his lunch. But um, he was such a good boy at the doctor's office. It wasn't his appointment. It was his brother's. But he was such a good boy in the office. And <laughs> his no. brother over here, it was his appointment, he's hiding under his bathroom, um, 
He screamed the entire time. It was miserable. But uh, there he is. He had his 15 month checkup. It's Mr. Tommy. Yeah, so we're gonna have some lunch now. All right, so here's their lunch. I just have um, some of those Uncrustables, peanut butter and jelly sandwiches, and um, some blueberries. Tommy is digging right in. Okay, well, that wraps up my realistic morning in the life with two toddlers and I'm 27 weeks pregnant. Um, I think I just want to note, like, is this not bizarre? Um, the pediatrician, like, the nurse, for some reason, I know it's, like, policy in their office. It's just a weird policy, but Tommy, like, peed all over the little pads on their scale. They're just disposable. It's just urine. I mean, it's not like he pooped on it. Um, she put them in a baggie and made me take them home. They usually have me take home the diapers as well, but I just thought it was extra weird. I had to take home it's like urine saturated tissue. I don't know, like weird. Um, if it was poop, I could understand. Maybe you don't want it to smell in your office, but <laughs> like, yeah, I just have this in my purse, like this baggie full of urine soaked tissue. It's disgusting. I don't really understand it. They're just eating lunch, and um, I'm just going to clean up the house before my parents are coming over to watch them tonight. All right, honey. Wait a minute. So my parents are going to come by and watch them um, while I go to work. I work four to midnight. So, yeah. My husband's working tonight as well. That's why they're coming over so, Grammy and Grampy are coming over later. Grammy and Grampy are going to come over and watch them. Um, yep, yeah, so I'm just going to clean up the house a little bit before they come over. Uh, fold that little laundry from this morning. And, yep, yeah, that's about it. So, thank you all so much for watching. You can please like and subscribe. I'd greatly appreciate that.